I'm headed to Urban Sketchers. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you where it's at, it's gonna be a surprise. But uh, it's a super fun group. We meet on Wednesday mornings, and uh, I, I went with them a lot my first few months here because like, I love art, obviously, and I like sketching, but it was such a good opportunity to get to know the area because we went to a different like coffee shop or part of the community or different town, different winery, different just like different places all over our like Tri-Cities area and the surrounding cities. It was just a really great way to get to know the area. So anyone who's new and if there's an Urban Sketchers in your area or if you're traveling, go with them. Like find where they meet up and meet up with them because it's super cool. But um, I haven't been able to go for a long time because I volunteer in the high school, but this morning I woke up, I didn't feel good, had a headache again, y'all know that. Um, and I was like, I'm not gonna drive. And so I didn't go to the school and so it's a couple hours later now I'm gonna go to Urban Sketchers for a little bit. I told you guys I was going. Uh, I'll turn around so you guys can see it real for a second. That's right, we're at Krispy Kreme. Hey guys, my voice isn't fully back, but I'm going to try to make it through this voiceover anyways. You can see this one was at the conveyor belt line at Krispy Kreme Donuts. And I did, this is the window part, so like right where you see through. And then the part I'm working on now is the bottom part. What I'm doing is, well I'm using the ink pen, this is one of my favorite ways to draw. But you can see this uh, white jar of ink is uh, pretty watered down. It's uh, it's a very light color, and I'll oftentimes do it underneath if I'm outlining a lot of stuff. And so you'll see like when it dries, it won't be very dark. It's going to lighten up quite a bit, and then I'll go back over it with darker ink in places where I want darker ink. But this is just for on lines I didn't want to be super, super dark. So you'll see that here in a minute when it dries. I actually really enjoyed doing the wall here, where it's a bunch of square tiles that are yellows, and actually you can see it behind me a little bit. It's a bunch of square tiles that are all oranges and uh, peaches, and pretty similar in color, but a little bit different. Alright, so I let it dry. Now I'm erasing the pencil lines, so you can see there's not a lot of dark on there. It's all pretty light. Now I'm going, uh, now I'm erasing I guess still. Now I'm going back in with my dark ink, and this is uh, ink that has not been watered down. I do not let water touch this, this bottle. I keep it pretty dark. So I'm outlining everything that I want darker, and I'll let you go and watch me do that for a little while. Well, I read the Urban Sketchers Manifesto to you guys. So our manifesto. One, we draw on location, indoors or out, capturing what we see from direct observation. Two, our drawings tell the story of our surroundings, the places we live, and where we travel. Three, our drawings are a record of time and place. Four, we are truthful to the scenes we witness. Five, we use any kind of media and cherish our individual styles. Six, we support each other and draw together. Seven, we share our drawings online. Eight, we show the world one drawing at a time. And I think that gives a lot of insight into what the group is all about. We meet, the my local group, we meet once a week on uh, Wednesday mornings and we go to different places each week and uh, just draw together. It's a really great supportive group. If people want tips or tricks, like we'll help each other out, but really we're just there to support each other and get each other drawing in it. Uh, if we don't do our art during the rest of the week, we all know that we will get at least one drawing in at Urban Sketchers. And so it's, it's just a great group of people. Um, there's other chapters as well. It's an international organization. They meet in um, the National Conference, I believe, was in Brazil this last year, and then it's been in the Dominican, and um, they were starting a East or a West Coast meetup as well. There's one in Oregon, and then this last one was in San Diego, and I think next year it's going to be in Washington. So it's just, it's just a cool group. Um, if you're interested in it, there's probably one near where you live, or you can go ahead and just start one. Start a group, start a meetup um, online, and see if people go, and you can go Go on your own and invite people, and there you go. You've got Urban Sketchers. So I told you guys I really liked the wall. Now you can see that I'm filling it in using an old brush. Sure. Isn't that what you're No, no, I, I got invited to be a speaker in China. Yeah, and then Yeah. And then uh, my flight got canceled in China, and I got so mad. So 
so that's my therapeutic piece. So. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. I love okay, it. So I got up at 5 o'clock in the morning, went to the airport at 2. That's right, you sit there and you wait in the airport, and it's like everybody looks like you. And they push each other, they put up, just, okay, let me have a coffee, and that's not your Pian pian chu hua, bu luo hang chu. Every snowflake falls onto its place. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and thumbs up for more art videos.